Hey guys, today I thought that I would make a more like vlog style what I eat in a day rather than my normal voiceover ones. Uh, those are the ones that I like to watch more of, so I thought I would try to make more of them. So this morning I woke up and I did fasted cardio. I rode my bike outside a couple loops around my neighborhood. Take a shower, now I have coffee. I am about to film a video for Graveyard Vomit, a makeup tutorial based on, fairly funny, don't eat them, based on these ears. On the docket today, film and edit this makeup tutorial, film and edit this video, I have to finish a commission. I have to work on the cover of a book. I have to go to the gym and maybe do another cardio or weight session tonight. I also have to watch kids, so it's gonna be a busy day. I'm gonna be practicing a little bit of intermittent fasting today. It's only about 9.45, so I'm not going to eat until noon. In addition to that, I am kind of sick. Everyone in my house is kind of sick because my nephew Isaac has started preschool and you know that means that he's gonna be bringing home like sickness for the rest of us for many years so we're all slightly sick and I'm gonna be focusing a lot on fruit today raw foods high vitamin C so I can feel a little bit better but yeah I'm gonna to get to filming this video I might show you how the makeup turns out bye for now I just finished editing the long version of that video it's exporting right now and I still have to do the like the mini Instagram tutorial version but I realized that I don't actually have to watch the kids today because today is Monday so they're with their mom um, so that gives me a little bit of extra time but it is noon so I'm gonna go make something to eat <laughs> So this is hopefully like a super vitamin C powerhouse that's going to help me. Well, I'm not gonna say that I have like a full blown cold right now, but like it will help hopefully prevent me from having one and feel a little bit better in general. But basically in here is a pineapple, like almost a whole pineapple. I cut a little funky parts off of it, but then it's one frozen banana and about eight ounces of orange juice. And it's awesome. So it's like 2.30 or so. I'm going to CrossFit box in like an hour. So I'm eating something so it has enough time to like settle because I know that's how my body works basically. <laughs> um, here it is. I have no idea how I'm gonna eat it. So it's two bell peppers. Inside layered is lettuce avocado and tomatoes and then I have like moon drops and I'm just gonna go for it it's gonna be in this <laughs> so I'm leaving for CrossFit now uh, I think we're working on snatch but I have no real proof <laughs> but I'll let you know when I'm done let me just show you what I bring I have a bucket inside is my bottle and an orange I don't know if you can see that. First time I ever like did a CrossFit class, I threw up. <laughs> I did a Metcon, uh, just a baseline one to establish like current athleticism, and I threw up. Now, if you're if you buy into that, like if you're prepared for something, it won't happen. Like when you bring an umbrella, it won't rain. So I bring a bucket so that I won't puke. And if I do, I already have a bucket, so nothing to worry about. See you on the other side. Hey, let me turn this down. So, um, we did work on snatch. Single arm kettlebell snatch. Uh, lots of stuff just kind of surrounding perfecting that movement. And then, guess what? I did the Metcon that I did on the first day. And I don't think I'm gonna throw up, which is, I think the biggest win, is I don't feel nearly as bad as I did last time. I'm a little shaky because I did a lot of hard work, but I beat my original time by over a minute, so. That was really cool. I'm really pumped. Um, 
probably gonna eat that orange right now or when I get home. Back home, rinsed off. I did eat the orange in the car and I have a chocolate protein shake. It's just protein powder and water. And I'm gonna get back to work. More and more drawing forever for the rest of my life. Just gonna do that till dinner time. I'm going to sign off here before I lose the light. That was my day. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and check out the description if you can support my Patreon. It would mean the world to me and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.